Okay guys, my name is Lens and I want you to join the Lens Empire by subscribing to my YouTube channel and also smash the like button. I'm Lens. Lens here. So I have this Dell computer here and it is not giving us any display on the screen as you can see currently it's off so i'm gonna go ahead and turn it on i turn it on and you can see the light there on the keyboard here it's on we are not seeing anything so i'm gonna show you how you can resolve this problem okay guys so here are we i'm gonna show you exactly how we can diagnose this issue yeah the first thing that we need to do is to ensure our cable is in properly which i'm gonna take it off you need to ensure that your vga cable is in properly and if it happens that you're using a HDMI cable you need to ensure that that is in properly that is step one step two we need to distinguish where the problem is coming from so we need to figure out if it is a memory problem or a simple problem and we can resolve this issue by unplugging the power cable which is this cable right here and hold down the power button for 10 seconds 10 to 15 seconds or so to be precise so that's what we need to do in diagnosing if it is a simple problem okay so the next step in which we are going to do we are going to power up the pc and if it happens that nothing works we would need to diagnose using an external video card which we can use here by the pci slot and if it happens that the onboard video card is bad if we try those steps that i stated a while ago and it failed we can try one of these video card and this is the video card slot right here as you can see it right here also there are video cards that can work with these slot right here these pci slots right here and also other cards that also can work with these as well so we are going to install this video card into this computer and if it happens that this video card give us something on the screen over here this means that the onboard video card is bad so this is a simple way how we can go about diagnosing our computer with no display on the screen and you can acquire one of these by searching on amazon or ebay for video card and you can search for 512 1 gig 2 gig it all depends upon you and the specification that you're looking for with your computer and what your computer is used for so we're gonna go ahead and insert this video card the first step that i'll need to do i'll need to remove the power cable as you can see there is a light here showing us that we have power going to the board so we need to raise this up and normally when you're gonna insert your video card there are different slots that you can pull out of the side we are going to insert this card right here there's a lock right at the mouth here that we need to pull by the side in order to get it down so now this is in
the video card is now inserted we're gonna use this VGA cable that comes from the monitor over there and we're going to connect it at the back of the video card Now what we're going to do, we're going to put back in the power cable. And now we are going to do a test, hoping that we will see something on the display right here so bingo guys bingo so as you can see that the screen is now showing uh, and this computer which is a Dell computer the video card in this computer is bad the onboard video card is bad so we just insert that video card right there that you're seeing there and that did the trick uh, as I said before there are different problems that can occur so I will advise you to use the necessary step okay guys so here you can see that Windows is now starting up and as I just repeat what I just said earlier concerning this problem this problem can be a simple problem where your VGA cable is not in properly you need to check your VGA cable that it is in properly also it can be one of those system error where your memory is giving some sort of problem so you need to ensure that your computer is booting up and if so I suggest that you try to drain your computer by turning it off taking out the power cord hold down the power button for 10 to 15 seconds turn back on and if that doesn't work then I suggest that you try one of those external video card to ensure your onboard video card is bad and if so you can just simply purchase one of those external video card so i hope that this video was helpful and i would like you guys to subscribe to my channel for more videos my name is lens and join the lens empire